hi there guys i'm back today with another video this video is a little bit different from what we usually do here on my channel today is a hair video now i'm just introducing you to some new hair that i'm going to be wearing because people always ask me where did you get your hair who does your hair how did you do that to your hair you need to show us how you did that to your hair I don't need to show you how I did that to my hair because the whole point is that you see it on my head and you ask me to do it for you. But apart from that, I will show you some of the stuff because there's stuff that you don't need to go to the salon for. You can actually do yourself because it's simple. And that's what I'm going to be um, talking to you guys about today. The hair that I'm wearing is from AliExpress. It's from some random seller. You don't even want to know where I got this hair from because, in fact, you know what? Let me not be horrible. The hair is nice. The closure is trash, but we made it work and I've got a tiny bit of my hair left out at the front around the sides. It's a wig. It's a wig. It's not a weave. I haven't worn a weave in years. Like I'm talking like probably like four or five years now. I have not worn a weave. Any hair you've ever seen me with on my channel that is not my natural hair is a wig. They're all wigs. I make wigs. I sell wigs. I make custom wigs for people are custom dye bundles and all that kind of stuff that's what i do so as i'm going on this journey and i'm discovering different hair and i'm paying more for hair and stuff like that and i'm doing different things with my hair i want to share that with you guys so today i'm going to show you some hair that just came through the post today from aliexpress so i ordered the hair from honey queen hair company and it's on aliexpress and i ordered three bundles of 24 inches and one 16 inch closure now when i opened the hair i was like why does the closure look so like this big because i wanted a frontal but in my haste to buy this hair because i'm impulsive when it comes to buying stuff in my haste to buy this hair i must have forgot or click the wrong thing so we now bitch got closure and some bundles but we're still gonna rock with just the closure and the bundles because why not so the hair comes in the standard plastic baggies bonnet net thing and this is the closure now i ran my fingers through it okay i wanted to feel how it felt and it's very very soft i like it it's got that kind of you know like that twist curl We'll see when I wash it how it behaves. It doesn't have like a, a horrible smell. It just smells like Brazilian hair. If you know that like Brazilian hair smell, it's kind of got like that Brazilian hair smell, but really faint. But do not be deceived at how hair looks like when it comes out of the packet, because I'm telling you, the dreams that you're sold, because when water hits this, the curl pattern could be completely different. But something I did like about the closure was they made it they made it thin they made it thin at the front like, i don't know if you guys can tell it isn't thick from the beginning like they purposely left space for baby hair it is a silk base closure i've never tried a silk base closure before so this is gonna be my first time working with these um but i watched a video on how to tint it because uh, my scalp ain't white don't know about yours i don't want to show you guys how to do that because i'm not a pro yet i'm just going to be trying it out and this will be my first time tinting a silk base i know how to like manipulate lace closures to look cute and stuff but silk base is a little bit different and as i'm learning i don't feel confident enough to show you guys when i am confident i will come and show you guys what is a good thing to do is i will leave my snapchat here um at the bottom somewhere Follow me on Snapchat for day-to-day -day stuff because I do stuff like this on my Snapchat all the time and I'm just snapping it so all my friends can see what my hair is going to be like. But, like, it's not a tutorial. Whereas this on YouTube, I feel like people feel like if you put videos on here, you must know what you're talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about, so I'm not going to put a video up showing you how to tint your lace stuff and then y'all go come at me sideways because I gave some bad advice. We're just trying to avoid that before it even happens. So I watched a guy. I will leave the link to his video down below. He said that you can tint it by painting a door hair dye onto the silk base situation. So I'm going to be trying that method. I will leave a link down below in the description box. So far the hair's cute. It's, it's nice. It's really soft and the curls appear to be pretty. Now that I've got three bundles of 24 inches so they're all this length. And they they all come in this kind of like twisty. They also came packaged in the plastic, 
and hair nets. And this is allegedly some unprocessed virgin 100% human hair, but we all know that y'all did something to get them all this wave pattern. So these are the three bundles of 24 inches. Now, the ends are full at the tips. I'm pulling on the hair and I'm getting some shedding, but I won't be able to tell you guys like what the shedding is like until after I've installed it and worn it for a little bit. I'm most likely gonna cut my wefts when I make my wig, so I'm gonna get shedding. How much will depend on how well they have done these bundles. It's just nothing special about this hair, it's just it's just from AliExpress. So you guys will see how the hair looks when I make the wig, I'll probably make a video with it tomorrow. And um, if you like it, let me know. And if you like these types of videos, thumbs it up. Thumbs up the video so I know that you guys like this and you're receiving it. Um, I want it, I want my channel to be like a social space. Like if you feel like you want to leave a comment down below, you do that. If you feel like if there was something you were thinking whilst you were watching this video, comment it down below. I'll comment back if I have something to say back. Like why not? I really want my social media platforms to be a place where people can come and learn and like dialogue is the way that we're gonna learn because that's how we communicate over social media via dialogue i'm gonna sharp now because i'm waffling like a beast and i'm gonna go and start constructing my wig so i will see you guys two videos in one week maybe we'll see bye guys